Martin. Here, 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 Martin. This one, you want me to, you're going to tell me what I think. There are more similarities between uh, rugby and diplomacy than you might realize. You lose, you, you lose a teeth. <laughs> We lose a face. <laughs> Your scrums confuse anyone who doesn't know the game, just like our debates. <laughs> For you, a goal is a try. At the United Nations, we try for a goal, like the Millennium Development Goals. I love to watch rugby, but the truth is, I do not play too well. I have never been much of a loose, loose, prop, loose head prop or a tight head prop, and I have definitely never been a hooker. <laughs> I may not be much of a player, but I am a huge fan of the international rugby board. The IRB has been working with the United Nations World Food Programs to help address world hunger. For seven years, uh, through the Tackle Hunger Program, you have raised awareness and funds that make a meaningful difference in people's lives. As the Secretary General knows, New Zealanders take both rugby and diplomacy very, very seriously. So much so that our Minister of Foreign Affairs is also the Minister responsible for rugby, I suspect. 